I challenged myself and decided to make a mixed media card in 10 minutes. Do you think it worked? Do you think I made this little beauty in 10 minutes only? I invite you to watch my video, join the fun and let's uh, create something together. Hello, hello everyone! Welcome to my YouTube channel. It's Marta here and as you can see I have desk full of beautiful goodies. Actually I walked around my studio and just grabbed really random things. Stash. Stash that I have never used or didn't use for ages. Stash that I kept for years. Time to use it. Grab things around you. Grab some um, card making base because I'm about to make a card in 10 minutes. Mixed media card, a little bit of a challenge. I found things that I really think m they are random but they may work together. What do I have here? Some scrapbooking paper which I fell in love with this uh, particular window that I'm hoping to maybe use it. I love the, as always, leftovers from some old book pages, cardboard, some chipboard. I have also packaging from actually my packaging. I have some um, ephemera, um, <laughs> no, doesn't matter. Uh, again, um, then we have some wooden chippy strange things, really, really very old stuff. So. I have also my uh, my clock ready, a uh, few other bits and pieces, and I have um, those are let me oil pastels from Prima. Why not? Why not to use something different? I have some um, ink as well. I have some modeling paste, structure paste, where from Lidl actually, which I haven't used for years or never. I'm not even sure. Anyway, um, time to set up timer, but before I do that, I need to tidy up slightly, slightly, move things around so I can, you know, be more prepared when we will start tearing everything off. And also my hot glue gun is ready as well to rock. So have that ready if you are setting the timer. Why do I set a timer? Oh guys, just because to have a fun, to challenge ourselves, to show you that it's possible to be creative and do things pretty, maybe sometimes not so pretty, <laughs> but in 10 minutes. Um, if I go over that, that's okay. If I will make it faster, that's fine too. There's not, it's not about being stressed over that. Please, please, please don't feel like this. Now, uh, I also have flowers, which are new, handmade gorgeous flowers in our shop. You can have a look. These are gorgeous for Amiran flowers made by by people like yourself, but like me, by beautiful friends of mine, crafter girls. Without any further ado, let me just grab my base of a card and let's start, shall we? It's gonna be, I think, fun and interesting. I hope anyway. I need big scissors as well. Dum -da -da -dum -da -da -dum. Okay, let's do it. Start. 10 minutes on the clock. Okay, where do I begin? I think I'm gonna begin with those actually just a book page, why not? So I'm hoping for some kind of mixed media sh um, mixed media, oh and no glue <laughs> that's not the best start, isn't it? So now the 10 minutes it's only really kind of, you know, it's just to have some frame, time frame, but there's no need for you to have a time frame if you don't feel like it, you know, it's it's fine, you don't have to okay, okay, now half minute gun. Don't look at the clock if you feel stressed over that but I know that 10 minute challenge of art journaling you absolutely love so I was thinking you know Marta you can do similar thing you can try to make a card in 10 minutes and actually this is just a simple cardboard and actually as far as I remember I think we've done a challenge like that and I've done five minutes mixed media cards and they were like I think there were three cards in that video. If I remember, I'll try to. <laughs> I will try to. Actually, let's get rid of that as well a bit. I'm gonna try to maybe give it a link at the end of this video or something. Oh, that's much nicer, interesting. One minute gone, or more even. Hmm, what else? What else we can add? A little bit of packaging. This is packaging from my product, which first time I'm tearing apart and first time ever using it, so that's. <laughs> that's all oh, I just I just cut my head that's okay when Hannah sees those things like uh, looking at my phone and she sees my face she's mommy 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 <laughs> that's so cute actually okay we have that we have that how about adding this as well sure why not 
Mm -hmm. I have some gesso around as well, so hopefully I can use a little bit of gesso. I have this paint. Mm, we'll see. We have two minutes gone, which is which is good. We have plenty left. Let's see what's here. I really grabbed a bunch of different things. Maybe tiny in a vintage-ish kind of team, but n not necessarily. Oh, this old... Oh, that's nice. I like that. Some kind of writing. So I'm trying to make some layers. I'm trying to make some interest. It's really random, so don't um, you don't have to follow what I'm doing. It's just an idea, just an example to show you that you can actually do it as well. If I can do it, surely you can do it too. Now, before I'm going to add this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my gesso. I will also grab just a spatula. Uh -huh. And I'm gonna go for uh -huh. go for gessoing a little bit here and there. Not with the brushes, you can tell purposely with spatula. Oh, I know what I can do. I can add a little bit of a thread. Why not? We have sem seven minutes left, which I think it's plenty. So let's not be stressed over that. Seven minutes, it's a lot. And you know what? I think it's good to challenge yourself for the first time. Try it, why not? Now, hmm, I had a different plan, f plan for tonight. <laughs> I wasn't planning to record a video, but then I was like, I didn't craft for a few days. Mm, it would be nice to actually craft to add a video to you or something. So yeah, I said, ah, oh, okay, why not? So Lucas paused his uh, news in t telly. I said, it's gonna be a challenge for 10 minutes only. So I said, it's gonna be fast. So yeah, so he gave me his phone as you can see I have the phone so I can have my I can have my uh, timer and you can still fully see it which is great. Now this at the end maybe. Now I'm going to pause it because stop it restart. Okay, because I'm going to dry my gesso a little bit. Okay, off off time I'm just going to add teeny teensy teensy tons teensy more, but only tan teensy teensy Okay, that's fine. Okay. Back to you. The card is, I think, pretty much dry. So let's move on and let's go to coloring part. And I'm thinking about this beautiful green olive. It's actually called olive. So I think it would be really nice. Oh, actually, <laughs> I was heating up this so badly, so strongly, that it's very warm now under <laughs> my fingers. Ah, oh, that's so nice. I like that coloring. A little bit of brown. Why not? Or this one, maybe. Um, I don't know. Or maybe this one. Quickly, Marta, you have definitely less than less than um, six minutes left, which is very little. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah, I'm just trying to make a little bit of fun with you guys because I know that many of you is saying, oh, too long video. <laughs> like last video was an hour long, nearly. Many loved it. So. You know, I'm trying to accommodate you all guys. I really really do and that's I think what I love as well about my creations that sometimes I feel like for something a lot long and all sometimes I don't and that's perfectly fine um, those chipboards also are from the shop because I just added some background set of chipboards super cute now I'm just cutting it because you don't have to use all of it. You can use part of it and work away with magic with the scissors and it's fine. Mm -hmm. We have some nice sets of chipboards as well. Let's see. Maybe. Like this or something. Or actually, look, that's even better. Ha, ha, ha. There we go. Do you know what? I'm going to get rid of all. The crazy, crazier the better. Okay, we have the middle part. I said about the door. Do I love the door? I really think I do like the door. But let me see. That's cute. What about if I'll just add them? No, that's too small, isn't it? But let's see if I'll have the door quickly. As my focal point, because I really wanted to use flowers as well. All the time. The time is really flying today, isn't it? <laughs> it is. That's okay. Now, Hannah is asleep last night. OMG. She woke up. I don't know what time was it. Because I had no phone next to me. Oh my. 
it was just a small nightmare. Um, she didn't want to go back to sleep at all, like, and yeah, it was <laughs> a very tough night. I think she was awake for like two hours or something. So, and Lucas was, come on, you have probably ate, you ate some something that upset her stomach. I said I didn't eat anything. Oh, come on, you probably did eat something, and in this in a secret. <laughs> I said no. Three minutes, three minutes left. I'm not too sure. Uh, no, actually, maybe. Mm. Now, when you do mixed media and especially so so um, not thought through mixed media, you may cover things, but that's okay. Don't worry about it. You know, don't worry about it. If you're covering things, if you're covering bits and pieces, um, no, that's too much. But this would work, I think. Do you know what? I like it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna add it. Something different something different today I like that that's a very little time guys <laughs> ah, off the paper off the paper I'm checking if the camera is recording it is actually phew <laughs> imagine that if it wasn't I'm like oh no okay so maybe somewhere along this so I'm grabbing more of my hot glue mm -hmm. so that it can go somewhere there okay nice one I don't know if this is what I want and need there at all or what's the story hmm maybe not so much and without much of a thinking let's just let's just add it and that's it and then I can always add something more or maybe two is enough actually I think oh, I love them flowers they are too good two is definitely enough how about leafy leaf <laughs> maybe maybe two leaves one minute oh that's very little <laughs> Marta you are about to fail hello that's okay oh there we go I like that now we need some title but before anything we need some kind of some kind of splashes one minute no way this is disaster <laughs> this is disaster I should think more about this project before press the record. No, I like it. I'm joking. I like it. I think it's fun. I think it's pretty. And it's different. I've really challenged myself recently trying to make different things, you know, a little different to what I usually would do. Um, what I wanted was that this one, no. What else I wanted to? Title, title. Let me pause for two seconds. <laughs> back to you. I had a little thinking about this and I'm not extremely happy with the door, with the window, but okay I'm gonna fail but look what I found. I found a chipboard that it's a window chipboard that I think it's absolutely perfect and it's gonna complement what I was kind of feeling missing here. So let's have a look at that. So you will see what I meant. There we go. Yes. Yes, I know, I know, I failed. <laughs> That's okay. Then I was thinking, why not to add tiny touch of chipboard as well here, underneath it, because it's just, I don't know, it's just something missing there. Let's just see. Let's just steal this two more minutes, but at least I, you will know what I mean. There we go. Just a touch. So it's like, I, I felt that it's like two something small in here. And then I found this gorgeous journey which I think it's a bit too dark for my liking but look you can use your pastel you can just alter it a little bit there we go and make it a little brighter now I have to say 10 minutes is a little time it's too maybe too challenging for some for me too as you can see it's not that <laughs> I know everything but I like that I think it's nice to um, to just stand there, just go for it, Marta. Just do it. You can do it. Just, just do it. So you know, 
And I think we learn from this kind of uh, journey. I think it's nice journey. I think we learn from this kind of um, experiences like that. So, to finish off. But I don't think it's fully finished because I wanted to add those dots which I lost. Where are they? Where are my dotties? And I didn't do any stamping, that's okay, but dots, oh yeah. I think this will nicely complement the rest because they are in those kind of colors. There we go. Love that. Mm -hmm. I think these are very old from what? Hmm. MME. My mind's eye, yes. Very, very old indeed. <laughs> okay, I love that. Now I think with those little touches as well, like finishing touches, it makes it, you know, it makes it, it looks nice. It looks nice, especially now with this tiny, teensy, teensy touches of some color that is just complement everything nicely. Oops, to finish it off. I'm glad I used things that I haven't looked into onto for like many years. So I encourage you to use your stash, guys. Use your stash. There we go. And voila, I can call this finished. Although I think it's a little too much color there. So I'm gonna grab a little bit of color there just so I have it there as well. Because I feel it's a little unbalanced is that a good word to say unbalanced possibly maybe or better idea I think maybe I'm gonna grab this take this off for now yeah 10 minute challenge turned into 15 <laughs> oh well oh well now I'm gonna just grab some white there we go and just okay I think it was too striking here don't you think it's a little it was a little bit too striking for my liking now it's perfect so I'm gonna add a different um, dot that will hold there which could be yellow or whichever there we go I like it now if you don't feel like something is okay don't worry don't be nervous of changing it that's okay you can certainly change that or maybe Actually, <laughs> why not? Why not to use this small flower? Just a little touch. Uh, so the window is not that bare, kind of, I guess. Mm -hmm. I like that. Now. Maybe here. Oh, there we go. There we go. Wow. Now I feel it's completed and finished. So, <laughs> something a little different. I'm going to show you my inspiration and how different things can turn out. I'll show you the inspiration to this. I love this project and you also did love this. It's a mixed media uh, project card that I've done a few months ago. It's uh, actually next to me on, in the studio because I love it so much and it's really done with very basic nothing. It's like a household items, no cost really. So this was a little bit as well in that kind of liking of um, a, a little bit of layers and elements that don't maybe suit you know don't match but the most important is look how different the outcome is so you can re be really you can finish off with something completely different to what I'm what I've done I think that the window is making the whole card now and it's just adding and popping and finishing this off so I'm glad I found that I, I came up with this because I, I love the the window itself but yes now it's I feel it's really nice and finished and yeah I love it okay I'm gonna wrap up with that. A very short video for tonight, but something uh, new is coming in a few days. I hope you will stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to hearing what you think. Uh, 10 minutes challenge card making. Will I be coming back to this uh, theme? Let me know if this subject 
if this is something you wish to watch more often. Thank you so much. I love you lots, but I have to go. Bye. Bye-bye.